really proud to be able to provide our patients with the most cutting edge care. And that is how our Michigan Egg Bank evolved, was that we wanted to help people to be able to get pregnant at a time that they wish to. And one of the greatest limitations is a woman's age. And how can we freeze time because we can't turn the clock back? We started doing research here on egg crop preservation back in uh, 2008. And we really were able to emerge the very successful on behalf of our patients. And we're one of maybe five egg banks in the country. And really we're on the cutting edge to be able to provide this. And we started with the technology to freeze eggs among our egg donors. And where it has typically been that a woman and a man trying to have a baby, or even a single woman or a lesbian couple want to have a baby, sometimes the eggs aren't right or their genetics aren't right. So now they can choose an egg donor. Egg donors donate when they'd like to, which means they're more apt to donate, and good quality donors are what we want with good eggs. And they can donate more often for the egg bank, more like a sperm bank. And women can choose their donor when they'd like and go when they'd want to very fast, as opposed to three to six months to wait to get a donor, and then you gotta wait for when the donor wants to donate to synchronize your cycle. And we've been able to do this and also reduce the cost by about half. So we're able to advance the technologies of egg freezing, reducing the cost, improving the access to care. That's sort of the holy grail in medicine. And that's what we're doing with our Michigan Egg Bank. And we find that outcomes from eggs that have been cryopreserved are just as good as if it were fresh. But we also have couples who wish to defer fertility for later. Personal egg banking. Women that wish to say, I'm 27, have a big career that's busy, I may want to freeze some of my eggs at 27, so when I'm 37, I've got 27-year-old eggs, and my chance of having a baby is much higher than at 37, and the risk of miscarriage or Down syndrome is much lower. So these are things that folks are now grasping and going to, and we're trying to make it as affordable as possible. But it is a huge game changer for women to have more control of their reproductive choices. It's awesome. In addition, with our egg freezing technology, we also offer egg freezing to women who are facing cancer and their cancer treatments. And at least in this day and age, certain types of cancer treatments or other ailments can hurt eggs. So they may want to bank their eggs in advance of their cancer therapy. And so this affords them more flexibility and good hope to have their families. And the nice thing is the doctors treating cancer are doing an even better job so people are surviving and having the chance to have children. And that's awesome, but be able to preserve their fertility in advance is important. And then when they want to have a child later, they can.